What's happening guys? Welcome back into the Drum Central YouTube channel. My name as always is Dave Major and we're here with another Lick of the Week. Now today we've got an absolute doozy, so grab the PDF that's in the link below and we'll get started. So today we're going to dive into the world of Ergo Borlai again and if you've never heard of him, please go check him out because he's an absolute monster. We're going to do what I call supercharged paradiddle diddles. Now a paradiddle diddle is one of the standard 40 rudiments and it's a non-alternating rudiment. It starts with the right hand, so it goes right, left, para, and then diddle, diddle. L uh, right, right, left, left. So para, diddle, diddle, right, left, right, right, left, left. Sounds like this. We've used it quite a lot. I've explained it numerous times from various different drummers. It's a super useful rudiment. What Ergo does is he play, plays the first note, the pa, on his left foot. And then the ra, which would now be the left hand, becomes accented. So you get pa, ra, de, do, de, do, pa, ra, de, do, de, do. But what he also does is he alternates it. So we're going to have left foot, left, right, right, left, left, left foot, right, left, left, right, right. So unlike a normal paradiddle, which doesn't alternate, this one does. From there, Ergo orchestrates the accent around and keeps the doubles on the snare drum. He uses the floor tom, he uses the first tom. He sometimes, instead of playing the left foot, plays the kick drum. So it's quite an open concept that I'm showing you today, which you can then explore and try some different ideas. Let's try it nice and slow without the metronome, just to see how it goes. And we'll see how we get on. Now let's try it with the metronome at 60 beats a minute. Now the challenge is, as the speed increases, not to hear the left foot as the upbeat, which is where my ear naturally goes to. Let's try and hear it as the one, two, three, four because it's quite common to play the left foot on the upbeat, the ta or the a ah of the beat. So one E and A, ah, two E and A, ah, one triplet and triplet, two triplet and triplet. So try and keep that as your one, two, three, four. And the best way, the best suggestion I can ever give to you is to count out loud. Let's try it now at 100 beats a minute and see how we get on. And now let's try it at full speed, 140 beats a minute. So there we have an absolutely monstrous manipulation of our standard rudiment. You can use that idea of substituting one of the notes of a normal rudiment for either a kick drum or a left foot. It makes kind of expands your vocabulary to no end. If you like this lesson, which I really hope you did, please hit subscribe and check out the Drum Central website. I'll catch you next time.